and welcome to Dog Painting at the Lexington County Public Library System. My name is Miss Casey and I'm so excited that you're here today. The first thing we need to do is gather our materials. We will need some paint of any color, a canvas, a Ziploc bag that is bigger than your canvas, some peanut butter, and a knife. And of course, you will need a dog. We are gonna go ahead and grab our canvas and our paint colors. When you are finished putting the paint on there, we are going to move on to the next step. For this step, we are going to need our Ziploc bag, peanut butter, and a knife. If your pet does not like peanut butter, feel free to spread whatever it is that they may like on the bag. Once you have your peanut butter on your Ziploc bag, you are going to open up your Ziploc bag and place your canvas with the paint inside of it and seal it up. Go ahead and grab your pup and let's get to painting. Once your dog has finished painting their picture, you can go ahead and open up that Ziploc bag and take their canvas and put it outside in the sun so it can dry for a bit. Ellie did a wonderful job. She sure is a true Picasso. Look at her admiring it. I just grabbed Ellie's painting out of the sun. It was in the sun for about 15 minutes, and then it's now completely dry. What you can do if there's space left over on your canvas is you can write their name and the year that they made it, or you can do it on the back. Since there's a little spot on the front, I'm gonna do it on the back. And here it is finished. Ellie did a great job. And things like this can make perfect gifts for dog lovers. If you don't have a dog, you can still do this with your pet. Just make sure that you use a type of food that they like and keep in mind the safety of your pet.